some men comfortable with going overseas to meet women and have sex. If I'm going overseas, I'm going with my own. I ain't going. That can happen right here in America. You know how they have the passport bros. We need the passport sisters. Most men in America like what we like. I ended up having a little bit too much fun. I ended up having a one night stand with somebody who worked at the resort. Obviously didn't use protection. Hey guys, welcome back to more to life i'm not gonna hold you let's get right into it now guys today we have more of the passport sisters now this woman right here her logic behind why more women need to be passport sisters just doesn't really make any sense but i'm not gonna hold you let's get right into it uh, let's get ready to rumble I'm confused. What does she mean most men in America like what we like? What is she trying to say? Most women in America like men? We don't do that here. I don't get it. I'm lost. Somebody please help me. I um, am flabbergasted right now. Most men in America like what we like. It seems like one of those shaming techniques, one of those shaming tactics that women say, oh, if guys don't want them because she, I mean, I got to call it like it is, right? She's a little bit overweight. She's an overweight party. So to say most men like what we like is kind of like when women say, oh, the guy doesn't like me, you must be gay when the guy just doesn't want to be with her. Women say that about guys sometimes and sometimes guys have to pick up a litter. They don't want to just be with anyone. What does woman turn around and say? Oh, they're gay. Why are you gay? But that was wild. But more passport sisters open and eager to see what opportunities out there. A lot of times women go, they want to adapt people into their ways and their ways only. And then, of course, I don't think she's looking for men to live up to a certain standard. If she is, she may, she may be. You guys see it all the time on Kevin Samuels' show. That's why Kevin Samuels is so popular. He would have women like this going on his show saying, I want a man making the back. And you tell him, hey, look, you can't compete with the woman that this guy is capable of getting. But anyway, guys, let's go on to the next one. Now you see that guys? She caught the bug at a resort in Jamaica. Ew. What are you doing? I mean, did the condom fall off? Are you out there just banging dudes raw? Which is crazy. Are you out there just being with guys with not, no protection? Pfft, let's get into it. I think it's time for another one. Um, but back in, I think it was what, 2007 now? Um, I went on a girl's trip with a few friends to Jamaica. Uh, we just went to go have fun, get away. And I ended up having a little bit too much fun. I ended up having a one night stand with somebody who worked at the resort. Um, and obviously didn't use protection. Okay. Came home and ended up getting really, really sick about a week after I got home. I was in and out of the hospital. They had a hard time finding what was going on because HIV doesn't show up in your blood that quick. And... So they finally did a spinal tap. They found HIV in my system and the rest is history. And here I am. <laughs> Funny thing is I, you know, I didn't know anything about the rafting part of that, but definitely I'm on the resorts. They're having plenty, plenty, plenty. That's the wild thing, right? They guys get bashed all the time for this. And you know, I feel sorry for that sister. I can't really point fingers at her, but this is sad, man. And this happens to some guys too. When you're out and you're overseas, sometimes what guys are doing, and same thing happened in Jamaica, right? Guys will be in Colombia, DR, maybe somewhere else. And when you're dealing with a woman at the night, they're woman at the night for a reason. And sometimes they do certain things for a little extra cash. Don't be the next victim. Okay. Strap it up, strap it up. What's the big deal? Let's strap it up, man. Strap it up, use condoms. Stop judging people. Stop judging females. They're there to have wrong. fun. If that's what they want to do, more power to them. I just suggest that they strap it up. That's it. Mm -mm -mm. Next video. Plus size women, if you ever felt insecure, if you ever felt like you was too big, 
If you ever felt like like you was just so wide, how you doing? Good, thank you. If you ever felt like you just so fat that no This is bad, man. If you ever felt like you was too big, if you ever felt like you was so fat that nobody wants you, lose some weight. How about that? They're making it okay for women to just be undesirable and then go to Jamaica. Now, it's a lot different, right? Now, are you going out there and marrying one of these guys? Because then that makes sense. That makes sense, but that's not happening. Because they're going out there and getting the diggings, the diggings duggins. Bro, what are you talking about, man? They're getting the diggings duggins. That's what they're going out there and doing. I just don't love you. Jamaica, they love us. Favorite is just the truth. Is what me say. It might sound sad. We are foreign girl. Them as opportunity first. Is what me say. might see we as love, but we see we as opportunity. So if me they are Jamaica, I may see a girl where they are Jamaica. Me not expect from her. Me never expect she to take care of my family. Them are take care of me. And I just look at Jamaican girl if come and naturally see her and like her. Foreigner, I look, I see opportunity. See, you know what these women, <laughs> I remember these dudes straight from yard, man. Now, women can sometimes be worse than guys, right? But you have women, eventually they fall in love. The emotions are different. These dudes now? Woo! Barf! 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 Woof! 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 They said, we see opportunity to till they pipe and get to America. Is what me I say before me even think about even know her. Me I say opportunity. Me I see the lifestyle she can make me live. And me I see say she can take me out better and carry me come foreign and make me can live some better life. Me now I see. I heard that, my man. He said me can live better life to win, 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 make happen. <laughs> 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 my action is off, but I get it. And they're trying to say it's the same with us. A lot of guys are taking time with these women. They're taking time. It's not just guys going over there going, hey, come on, be my wife. Or come on, be with me. Some guys do that, which is wrong, right? I speak against that. You have guys that come here all the time where I am now, you get taken advantage of. And I make sure to, to talk about it. So guys know, look, don't do that. Don't be the guy that falls for this cheaper keeper. That's for another video. As somebody with me, I love and want to stay with you the rest of my life. Meanwhile, <laughs> yeah, guys. So now on to the next video. Crazy the way this Jamaican man woke me up after my rap ride while my friend had not been a girl. Oh baby, talk come on. Oh baby, talk give me this. Me I go show you love. That's the way you feel. The green car bros up. Nice. Forget the passport bros, these green card bros is doing it. Nah, I'm joking, but you guys know what I mean. They're not doing it. They're doing what they have to. Uh, let me skip to that, that next one, to the next video. The, uh, you know, copyright central. Why are some men comfortable with going overseas to meet women and have with them? Condom or no condom, because you can still catch diseases. Are y'all not worried about catching a disease that you cannot get rid of? Yes. I, I re Listen, tell that to the other lady that went to Jamaica, right? Now, if guys are doing that, it's totally off. I know. I wasn't going around looking to just do that and be done and something raw. And Why are you judging that guys are doing that? Like, what are you automatically assuming that? I would like to know. Why are you comfortable with going overseas? I am afraid that that's crazy. I'm gonna cry. <gasps> if I'm going overseas, I'm going with my own. I ain't going. But that can happen right here in America. I'm going my own. Imagine you don't got a guy. How are you going to trust him? Not use protection. You're going to attempt. Same difference. Get something. You may come back with something you can't get rid of. Mind your business, that's all. Mind your business. So why are men so comfortable with going overseas, meeting women to have sex with, with a condom or without, because you still can catch something? Please, for those that do it, keep it real. And for those who don't, I understand if you can't. But um, be amazing on purpose and let me know what's really going on. I don't get the point of the video. Like, it really didn't make any sense. Oh, you just want to know why you guys feel comfortable going over there to, to have unprotected sex? Like, what's your whole point? Some guys do, some guys don't. 
I don't understand the point of that video. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching this video. You guys already know, it's more to life.